Thanks for staying with us. If you're just tuning in, it's our ladies' night out. And let me and let me and Mori wants to they want to crucify me. We're asking, right? Um, we are asking if tact can be explored as a strategy for building a better Nigeria. That's my question, no? And how should we go about that? Please let us hear what you have to say. Remember, you can join this conversation. Tweet at us at Wayshow Africa One with the hashtag Wayshow or send us an SMS or WhatsApp to 081 803 And our phone lines are open. Please. Take it easy on me. <laughs> I'm not the one. I'm just asking questions here. All right, so Lamy wanted to come in before we went on a break. No, you were talking about engaging your representative, yes. writing them a letter, and I was talking about accessibility. Are they even accessible in the first place? And do you, do you know who your House of Representatives member? Mm. Do you know who they are? Can you tell me who they are? You can, I want you to answer me now. <laughs> The local government chairman in your area, do you know? I just moved to a new area, so I don't know the local government. I know the one of the old one. Who are? Who are? Who are? Who are? Who are? So how do you engage are? them? OK, so let me, Mori, yeah, go ahead. Who are the NYC ally? Like I was saying before we went on break, you cannot even, you cannot reach them. Before you talk to your ally, you have to talk to somebody that will help you talk to them. Anybody that is holding any government position, you can never yes. talk us about local talk to us about talk to us about your local government chairman. So I'm just going to now write letter, they will now give my letter to Bolgisela and everything will just die there. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to risk my, my writing going to waste. So Sorry, to they would even say, arrest you when you go in there. So they all arrest you like you are a criminal. All you prefer to do is to Sorosoke and go on social media. But is it yes. yielding any results? I mean, that's the only channel, why not? Okay, so let me take some comments. Let me take some comments. Um, all right, so this is from Zaria Corey or something, Raphael Corey. He says, emirs are not politicians or activists. So rather than bringing the throne to ridicule, so the Kano state government decided to reduce him to a blogger or a political analyst. We must not allow our radicalism to take the place of reason. That's from Akori from Zaria. Then um, Benson says, the meaning of tact skill and sensitivity in dealing with others or with difficult issues, right? It is the skill and sensitivity with dealing with difficult issues. Now, he now says, even children eh, apply so much tax to get what they want. Without tax, you, uh, you get nothing. It's a skill we need to learn, master, then apply it to get results. That's from Benson. Then, um, good evening, ladies. Mori is has defined right. There must ha, there must have been um, behind closed doors uh, talks. Sanusi needed people to know his stance. That's from um, Maymuna. Then um, I don't know who this person is. Is it Forza? That is your name? I have seen no tact play out, and the effect of tact also play out. Trust me, tact pays more. It says I must say we have a, a youth that have been. Tact for 80%, just a political class that uses the only tool they have, which is force. Ah, okay. Um, then Mahmoud from Niger State says, Sanusi speaks a lot. He did not use tact in handling issues. Um, he cannot even solve the problem, but keeps talking uh, talking now and he's out. He should join governance and begin, begin the work. I think I have a call. Let me take a call first, then I'll come to you back, ladies. Sorry, when you're calling in, please, can you just turn down the volume of your television set? Hello, thank you for joining us. Let's hear what you have to say. Uh, hello, good evening, ladies. Thank you for joining us. Uh, I've actually been enjoying your discussion and what you've been talking about. But I want to tell you something. Is it Nigeria? major problem is us, all of us, mm -hmm. me, you, all of you there. We don't want to make things work in this country. If we go over things, we make things work. But if we are here, everybody is the boss or everybody is the owner. And for the Sanusi issue, he is a Nigerian and he knows the problems. He was the owner of Kano. What kind of love? Every day you talk, 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 talk. Why don't you pay attention? Why don't you help out this, the people, the poor people? Not always attacking the government. And for the instance, guys, let me be very honest with you guys. 
Anybody that really wants to change the government, I want to make it work in this country today. Let them join the political scene and wait for 2023 and push these guys out. Hmm. But going to protest and stopping other people from going for their own business day in, day out, I think it will get. That doesn't make sense. Right. But Lacaruna, like, whatever he calls himself, he just wants to make it popular. These are guys that are going to give positions like the government chairman. They cannot perform. Mm -hmm. They can't even perform anything. They always talk, 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 talk on TV, uh, social media. Let them go to their villages. Ask them when was the last time you went to the village. Now I see the way people are talking there. Now I help people. Ask people like uh, the video and co. When Absolutely. was the last time you went to their villages? Thank Let you so much, I hear. We have so many calls coming in, so we don't want to keep um, keep all of them waiting. Okay, so let me come to Lamy. I think Lamy has been itching to say something. No, 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 no. But okay, <laughs> I was so, going to say, yeah, that there's no way you can engage the government tactfully. It's your I, right. No, but I don't agree with you, Lamy. Rolake says, how do we handle um, government better? I really don't know. We must all start thinking deeper on how to solve this problem. Hashtag wigs. Hashtag difficult to solve. Hashtag we keep trying. Then uh, tag, tag, tag in Nigeria. And that's what Choma says. See, let me tell you something. We've continued this thing time and time again, and we've not seen a result. I am just saying that can we be a lot more sensitive to the kinds of leaders, the crop of leaders that we have, right? Because look at what happened in this uh, lecky, um, the rearrest of protesters that you're talking about. Does this tell you that these leaders care about whatever you put on social media anymore? They don't care. Because so they, are they going to now care about you applying tact? Well, they, do they, do they but have we tried that, that strategy, Lamy? Have we tried that strategy? Go ahead, Mori. Yes. They care. they care. And that's why nobody died in the rearrest. And that's why nobody died. Because they care. If not, they would have killed somebody. They would have killed people. But they know that we will come and drag them by the neck. So they care. Okay, so the, the or maybe maybe they don't care. Maybe they are just scared. Whatever it is, is doing something to them. I truly. Yeah, okay, me. okay. All the times that we have been tactful, what 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 has the Nigerian government done? The Nigerian government does not care. So to even put small fear in them, what we need to do it is in fact. Social media calling them what is a, is a it's kind not, of tact. Okay, so, Maury, is it fear we need to put in them or we need to get them to that point to see that they must take up their responsibilities? Which one in, do you in want? In the process of getting them to that point, if it's fear we'll first put, it's step by step. Instead of not putting them, they were too relaxed before. All of them were just chilled, like they don't care. If Nigerians want to die, let them die. Huh. At least now I feel like they're going to take extra measures. They will not do that. Your government doesn't care about you. Or they don't care. Okay, so there's this... Keep quiet. So you might, you might as well fight. Okay, so there's so this... You're right. Lami, there's this, there's this thing I've also observed. And I think it played out in this NSAS protest where it seems like the people that want to sit down to reason with the government, we Nigerian youth, you're all of us, our young people, who say the person has compromised. Do you understand? Right? There are people that can truly sit down and talk to this government. But we are not going to allow them to talk to them because we feel that they will be compromised or they would be bribed or something. Wow. I believe that there are tactful Only people two. in this. Why are you talking to one person? Why are you talking to one wow. person? Come online and address the entire youth. Why do we have to have a leader? Why do we have to have a leader? Okay, wow. let me, let me wow. hear you. Worry, listen. I don't believe in the power of protest and all that. I believe in the power of votes. Wait for 2023 and put them out. That's the only thing. That's the only tool as a, as a citizen that I think we have. You will just scream from morning till night. Nothing will change. I even like what is happening. It will be a bitter reminder to us in 2023 to actively... Oh, we're losing Lamy. We're losing Lamy. Okay, Ra Rafael Akoki again has sent, says, NSAS, but I don't think this present democracy is working for Nigeria because we are yet to come to the realization that military approach and their methods of governance are no longer fashionable in the 21st century. Telling truth to government is a very scarce commodity in the country, and no one is ready to be blacklisted for speaking the truth. This is why insecurity is surging every day because we, are, we as a country continue to value, I mean, we as a country continue value unity for the truth. We need 
a reorientation as a nation. That's from Raphael. Um, <clears throat> Benson has said, ways, ah, with exclamation mark in red. Benson, what did we do to you? If the desired result is not achieved, the tact applied is considered not effective. So this is my point that I'm trying to get across to just you and Mori, Lami and Mori. And you are not even getting me. All these things that we have done, Soros, okay, oh, protest, oh, this one, that one. The results that we fought for in the first place, or what we were fighting for, did we achieve that? The answer is no. So why can't we devise a new strategy to handle this Nigerian government that we have? Like the I only strategy is to go out and vote in 2023. No other strategy. I can't be pleading for my rights. They are my rights. How do I have to put people in and start pleading for them to do the right thing? Why? Okay, so let me hear your final advice then, since you say you want to plead for your rights. Because even this political, this politics that you're talking about voting, you need to be able to oh, infiltrate. I Wait, now let me finish. You need to be able to infiltrate the political parties that are powerful. You need to be able to infiltrate those political parties. And how do you go oh, into I those political parties? Oh, how do you win the election? You can't stand against the party, the current parties that are there. Mori, let me hear Why you. did you say that? Okay, let me continue now. Let me hear let you. Let me hear you, Mori. Mori, yes, let me hear you. <laughs> oh, this that I, the way that you are defending these people is making my left eye to be twitching. But wait, <laughs> imagine that you have you have a phone, or oh, you have a phone, and you tell the phone, call faith, and the phone says, why should I call faith? Will you not be angry? The, the thing that I bought with my money is asking me the reason why. So that's the thing. Why you are saying that we should be begging these people for the things that we deserve? No, you are. You see, now mind you, you mind, mind you, mind you. We have been doing these things nicely for for years and years and years, and we could not take it anymore. And we came out to talk. And you are saying we should devise that. Which other means? I don't want to know what you want to do. If that protest thing did not work, nothing can work on the Nigerian government again. So start writing <laughs> IELTS. That's the way forward. Mori. I don't, I don't I don't subscribe to that. Mori. Hey, Miriam, Miriam, I don't subscribe. Oh, it's okay. To that. That's what I subscribe to. I'm going to go and start writing my IELTS. So I have two options. So I know that where I'm from, they don't listen to me. At least I have another option. Mori. Because it's actually draining. It's actually is 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 tiring. It's like a very tiring situation. I can't even like you're walking in the afternoon. If if somebody is chasing me and I see police station, I don't know if I will enter or rather maybe go back to who is chasing ah, me. Mori, show you who was, exactly. What show kind you of who let me talk. Because become the accused. What the kind accused of is that? The you will see a crime scene going on. You won't be able to call police because what is the point on top of your head? Okay. That's so. the state that this country has gotten to. Is 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 rotting. Nigeria is rotting deep. Okay, so um, this, is, very sad. this is the quote, and this is what tact is. Tact is not, you, you said something, Mori, and I want to correct it. I've not asked us to go and beg this government, no. I've not asked us to go and, um, you know, be subservient to them, no. What I've said is the quote by Winston Churchill that said, tact is the ability to tell someone to go to hell in such a way that they look forward to the trip. Do you understand? You're able to be affirmative on your point. You are able to drive home your point without them even having an air of like maybe you are insulting or you are, but you have driven your point home, right? The Nigerian government. That is my point. <laughs> Let... Bua, what I am saying. So I think I cannot I win this with you people. Should... The Nigerian government. Matter. Maybe That's you are saying relationship. If you are saying personal relationships with my brother, with my Thank child, you. with my husband, okay. Yes. But with the Nigerian yes. government, hey. Yes. Yes, I don't think so. I don't think that's a strategy. I don't think so. It's my right. So why do I have to beg? Why do I have to apply? To okay, so what to strategy you are right? what strategy are you talking about? Because, because Rosalind has sent in a message for you, Lami, and she says, Lami, will your vote count? What strategy are you suggesting that we use? At least vote first. Vote first and then wait to see if it's going to count or not. If I feel my vote is not going to count, I don't vote. You feel it's not going to count, you don't vote. Then who votes? Go out first and vote and see if it's not going to change. Why don't we experiment with it? Okay. 
I give up. And your vote counts. So your vote is what put the current president in power. So your vote counts. Because I didn't vote. Your vote counts. It counts a lot, in fact. That your vote. Hey, it counts so much. You don't even want to know. Okay, so. But I rest my case. So it doesn't look like I'm fighting me, war on the show tonight. I've rested my case a long time ago. <laughs> I've given up on both of you because I thought we were going to have. <laughs> A strategy to bring up this, I mean, to follow up this issue. But what you, but strategy? What I, strategy I, I, than to go to the 2023 and change the government? What's the other strategy? It's okay. I, I'm not saying anything again. Okay, so Benson says, the government is made up of people. The politicians apply tax always. Do we know this? And that's the truth. You guys might not know this, but the truth is politicians are the most tactful people. They know how to make uh -huh. their enemies. Listen now, let me finish. They know how to make their enemies their best friend when it comes to the common goal, which is the political power that they are fighting for. So why are we not understanding this strategy and matching them game for game, tact for tact? I don't understand. But you know what? I rest my case. Since both of you are saying that uh, it cannot work, I will leave it like that. We might bring it up next week Thursday, but I'm not sure. <laughs> Thank you, ladies. <laughs> All right. Oh, it's been a very interesting conversation. Ways was birthed from the need to inspire, influence, inform, um, inform lives towards action. And this year, we're starting our CSR focus on curbing unemployment in Nigeria. Now, in, if you're a company, please partner with us by allocating internship slots. And if you're a job seeker, keep watching Ways and follow us on all our social media handles, as this will be an all year round engagement. And keep telling all your friends to keep all their eyes on Ways. Are these ladies around at all? You know what, in case you missed today's quote, here it is again. Tact is the act of making a point without making an enemy. This is all I'm trying to tell these women. If you are able to make your point without making the government your enemy, then you have applied tact. That is all we are asking. And they are not, they are not getting me. But we'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow is another day. We live to fight another day. We'll see you tomorrow at 8 p.m. as we bring you another great conversation. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs>